okay? It's all right. It's okay. You now take sides with your mother to insult me. It's okay. You now invite men into the house, into my house, to bring you gifts, Papa It's okay. And you don't have guts to boast about it in front of me. Perpetua! 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 Okay. Perpetua, you want to disgrace me, eh? Mm. To God! Uh, if I don't give you a scar before you disgrace me! Anyway, you will not have her! Okay. Yourself, if that is what you want. Are you not in love again? <laughs> Go to him, let him kill you. Stop disturbing me here. Mama, please. Mama, mama please. Mama, please, I'm afraid he's back out here, please. I am going back to sleep. <laughs> if you like, go back to your love. If you don't, stay there and cry and knock until the spirit of the night will catch up with you. Mama, Mama, please! Mama, please, don't cry! Mama, I'm your daughter, Mama! I'm your daughter, Mama, please! Mama! Mama, please, don't put the gun for me, Mama, please! Baba's friend, yes. He said that Pepe wants to see him. At this time of the night, he has going to sleep. Come back tomorrow. Please wait. I have no way to sleep. Just tell him that Perpetua wants to see him. I'm sure he would like to see me. Perpetua, wait. I'm coming. Anything the matter? Sorry, sorry. Come inside. Come inside.
somebody here. Have you greeted her? Yeah. How are you? Fine. Um, I hope the guest room is okay. Yes, sir. All right. Then you, you now go and uh, prepare warm water for her to have her bath. Okay. Yes. Okay, my dear. Uh, what kind of food would you like to eat? I have different kinds of food in my house. African food and Beke food. I have canned mushroom, canned corn, and canned beans. And canned everything. I have assorted drinks, cola, spirits, and wine to pep you up. Just mention what you want to eat and it shall be served. Don't worry, I'm okay. No, 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 no. Remember you're in my house. You have to take something, baby. You must eat something. And uh, you've not even asked me why I came to your house at this time of the night. Uh, yes, yes, it's true, it's true. And, but, Pepe, you know that I am captivated by your beauty. You know it. But anyway, it's true. And, by the way, please, what is the problem? a guest room so that I will ask you to sleep in my own room. No. There will be time for all that if I marry you. Not so? And he's beautiful. Thank you very much, my dear. You see, this room is nothing to compare with the one I will share with you when I marry you. I will definitely spoil you with comfort. In fact, I will embarrass you with good things of life. And then you will go into the marketplace and proudly beat your chest. I am Petra and then Otava. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Thank you very much, my sweet potato. Thank you. You relax, eh? Sleep well. My palm oil. <laughs> Gentleman must serve his lady. Hmm. 
I never knew you speak so much grammar. Oh, you didn't know that I'm a grammarian? Yes. My teacher during my secondary school days, a white man, Mr. O'Rice, used to call me a grammarian. Yes, Mr. O'Rice was his name. I heard he is dead now. He traveled back to Ireland and died of pneumonia. Oh, what a pity. You see, my angel, you know English. You know grammar yourself. All these stupid girls in this community would have said, Oh, sorry, <laughs> as if they were the ones that killed Mr. O'Rice. Yes. <laughs> yes. Please eat. This biscuit is not local work. It's not local at all. Yes. My papaya. <laughs> yesterday night. Eh? God has finally brought back my lost dream. <laughs> Mama, how could you be so heartless? How could you have locked me out in the beginning of the night? Your only daughter, the only one that said I should not interfere with your life with that wretched carpenter. Why do you have to come to my house to disturb me? So Why? Okay, it's okay, my in-law. Eh? Everything is fine now. My palm oil is now in my custody. <laughs> This is just little twenty thousand naira. Eh? I want her to use it to take good care of herself. You know, living in that woman's house has rubbed dust on her shiny skin. And it is my duty eh, to make sure that her skin shines like glass again. <laughs> well, 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 well. It's just 20,000 naira. Eh. Mm. You see what I've been telling you? <laughs> hmm? This is how a sister should take care of your welfare. I hope they have cured your madness. Oh. Not when I know comes to pay your bed price now. You run away. <laughs> my see how he has been taking care of us. See it too. See how this money will be. Uh, my in law. Pepe and I understand each other better now. Mm -hmm. You see, um, you need to go close to somebody before you find out that the opinions formed about that person in the past are wrong. That is true, my in law. But we need to. Let me ask her in your presence now. Perpetua. Can Elo Taba come and marry you now? Mama, please. Mama, please. Honestly, my in law. There is no need. Honestly, there is no need for that question now. Eh? I have seen Pepe's action since yesterday night. Mm -hmm. eh? <laughs> action is so sweet, slower than words. Pepe, Pepe. Yes. <laughs> I the end of the whole exercise, the whole community 
As for me, I'm tired of fighting. I'm tired. Just like that. So you want Enotaba to take her? Just like that. I haven't paid a copper on her as bride price. Emma has money. Yes, he has money. And now, I even heard she slept in his house the very day I drove her out. Hey! Huh. 
It's okay. So, how much are you going to sell the shop and everything it needs to me? Well, because it's you, just bring 40,000 naira. 40,000. Mm. Mm. I'll take the shop. I'll take the shop. Come by this time tomorrow with a little paper of agreement. Then I'll pay you the cash. But it's going to be 30,000. Ah, ah, nam, now. Ah, ah, you know my shop is worth more than that now. Ah, how can you pay me 30,000 naira? You can't give that now. You have to consider now. Things are very hard. I'm over. I, I did not plan buying the shop. It's okay. Just because of the story. It's all right. It's okay. It's okay. I'll come tomorrow. Come tomorrow. What can I do? I'll be a rejected man. Something I can do. You are sleeping in the Baba's house. Tell! Warm, you. You want to go to the city? the city to do business. You. What business do you know? What business can you even do? <laughs> Please, I didn't come here for you to laugh at me. I didn't even come to see you at all. I actually came here because I didn't see Pepe at home. I thought she would be here. Anyway, I came to inform her about my going away. <laughs> well, do you really want to know where my beautiful Perpetua is? Please, where is she? Okay. She's in Anna's house. In fact, she slept there since yesterday and she has not yet returned. So that's where she is. She's enjoying herself. But she's having a nice time. The man is giving her so much love. Much more than you can give her. In fact, much more than you have ever given her. <laughs> but you see, she's enjoying herself. <laughs> Just look at you. You cannot do business here in the village where you know your way around. You want to carry yourself to the city. Where you can get lost any second. <laughs> Mr. City Businessman, will you carry your yourself out of my canteen? Business tycoon. <laughs>
this is salad. Well, I've been prepared for you. To me, they are nothing. They are nothing new. Yes, this is stockfish. What about you? Aren't you eating? I'll eat later. This is specially prepared for you. For me? Yes. <laughs> eat. Thank you. Since you came into my life, happiness is my next name. But I have always seen that you are not as happy as I am. You are always lost in thought. What do you always think about? Tell me the truth. Wama. You said you wanted the truth. I told you. Sometimes I wonder if I'm doing the right thing. Maybe I was too quick to leave him. Maybe he shouldn't be here. shared so much together. He was like my husband. Sometimes I feel, I feel I've not been fair to him. You see, you pity him. Forget him. After all, you are not the God that created him. God will take care of him. Yes. Will you be my wife? Are you proposing to me? Yes. And if I say yes? Are you saying yes? What if I say yes? I will arrange for a traditional marriage in a month's time. Will you be Mrs. Emma Otaba? Um. Every woman wishes to marry a man who she's guaranteed security and also a man she can love. And a man who is not stingy in spending cash on a woman he loves. Well, I guess I can love you. And, um,. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Do I give you some time to think about my proposal to you? No, I already have an answer for you. But uh, there is something I have to do first. Please. Mm. It's okay. Enjoy your food.
just the beginning. I will nourish you. I will cherish you. I will give you comfort. Anyhow you want it. Thank you. See, I'm a man of class. I'm not a local man. Have you come back home? Wama, I love you. But I have to go. You and I are no longer like oil and palm kernel. We quarrel all the time. You even beat me now. Anna respects me. He cares about me. He cares about my little feelings. Things you took for granted because you know that I love you. Have you come here to compare me with another man? Have you come here to tell me how I'm not man enough for you again? Perpetua, have you come here to wake up my pain? No, I have come to free my conscience. You and I have gone through a lot together. Good times, bad times. Laughter and joy, tears and sorrows. But something died in me the very day you hit me and heartlessly chased me into the night. Came back to your house, locked your door and slept. Without even giving a thought whether I came to any harm or not. Walking about in the middle of the night all by myself. Wama, tell me. What kind of man would do that to a woman he says he loves? As you can do that to me, only God knows what else you will do in future. Petra, I will not beg you. If your love for me is not strong enough for you to forgive me and forget our quarrels, then do as you wish. Pride will be your downfall. Goodbye.
neighbor will be the biggest wedding this village and the neighboring villages has ever seen. So we need to plan well. Yes. Uh, my neighbor, take note. I am going to kill two cows, six goats, and I will buy a long load of assorted drinks so that everybody will drink and eat to his or her satisfaction. And they shall know that Elne Otaba has taken a wife. Ellen? <laughs> Elne! You man with Naira! It's me! Mama! <laughs> Mama, I don't think I need all that noise. All I want is, it's just a quiet and simple traditional wedding. No, my daughter. You need all the noise. You need it to let the entire village know. Let them see that you can shine again. Let them know that you are not succeeding in your life. Let them to know. Let's make the noise. Yes. Are you afraid of? The noise is there. Yes. Uh, get yourself for the attributes. I will pay for the advice. Yes. I have to know. See her for a second. Are you blind? Can't you see we are busy? But please, can I see you? Um, Irema, I can't come to see you. You can see my friends is here, and we are very busy. Papa, is that how it is now? Is that how things are going to be for us now, Papa? The young lady does not want to see you. Is it by force? I wonder. Eh? You can see we are busy. We are ready for our traditional money. And we are here to stop you up. And you to buy for the future. Where can you go? Eh? Where can you go for your job? Outside. When you're done, I'd like to see you. Uh, go and wait for her outside, eh? Uh, while you are waiting, just make yourself useful by splitting those firewood outside. You know there's no man in this house. So wait outside. Uh -huh, my dear Pepe. Um, how about the 40 I should be guess? Or do I make it up to 60 or 70? No, my love, 47. Yeah, but I'll be the one to buy the list so that I'll buy good quality. Oh, no problem. Money is not the problem. In addition, if you want other women to have their own I should be to follow you behind, lend them. Hey! What <laughs> The money is there. Oh, no, no! You don't have to do that now. And you don't want to get all of them. Don't you think that uh, with all this crowd now, we should increase the number of cattle, the number of goats? So I'll have enough meat. Okay, I know I have crowd, I will have crowd. Yeah. Yeah. I will mean, you know what with your heart. Uh, let's make it like four, four cattle. No problem. It's just a question of cash. Is there? My God. This is what I've been going through. I came here for advice because you once advised me on the need for togetherness and love between two people who are lucky to love and respect each other. My advice to you in this matter is simple. Leave the girl alone. Yes, leave her. Uma, you know you have made every effort to bring her back with no success. Huh? Let her decide whom she wants. You or the other person. Naigabe. Huh? This decision is not hers alone. 
Yes. She's under the influence of her mother and the Ene Otaba. Since you have talked uh, with her mother, I suggest you go and see Ene Otaba. Yes, go and see him. Go to his house. Sit him down. Talk to him man to man, face to face. Eh? Tell him to hands off your woman. Then uh, listen and know what he's going to reply. You want me to go to his house? Ah, go to his house now. Are you not a man? Is he not a man? Go to him and see him and talk to him. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Uh, 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 you have not tasted the drink. Go and see him. Yes, who are you? Uh, tell your master I want to see him. What is your name and where do you come from? Tell him easy, but the best uncle. Hmm, your uncle? What are you doing? Huh? Okay, I'm done. 
please don't be angry at me for returning the money you paid for my shop. Please, I've changed my mind about leaving the village. It's even good. Ah, why should you even run away from the village just because of perpetual error? Stay here in the village and show them the stuff you're made of. That's what I will do. I will stay back and work hard until God smiles on me. And Perpetua will know that I'm not a failure. She will know that the very day she lost me, she lost a good man. Yes. Thank you, my brother. Ah, this thing is too much. I'm here. See your daughter. I only came to see Pepe Perpetua. Pepe is not here. Then where is she now? <laughs> Why are you asking such a stupid question? Eh? She's where she's supposed to be now. In her husband's house. That's where she belongs. Eh. Eh. In that case, I'll, I'll wait and sit here until she comes back. I can see you don't have any good thing to do with your life. You want to sit and wait for somebody's wife? A married woman? Okay. Go ahead. Sit down and wait for her. I'm glad I, 
I, I need money. I need money urgently, please. You see, that's why I want to sell this place to you. Very nice place. I know you love them. You see, you need them for your you business. Okay, you know? right. okay. So uh, where are the plates? Uh, the plates are at home, but I'll get them to you as soon as I get home. Eh? I'll bring them to you, please. It's all right. It's all right. All right, so how much do you want to sell them? Uh, 8,000 naira. Uh, yes, eight thousand, eight thousand. A very nice place. I need the money urgent. Very urgent, very urgent, please, very urgent. I don't know. For you, I'll do anything. <laughs> thank, you, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Sir. All right. Oh, sorry, Wilma. Yes. I don't know how you're going to feel. There's something I'd like to ask you. Uh, is it true? They say that Perpetua has left you for an hour Is it true? They're all lies. Don't don't mind my enemies. They're just spreading false rumors. They're all lies. Lies. Don't mind them. Does it mean? Both of you are still together. We are still together. We are still together. Uh, 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 let me go and bring the plates to you. Uh, it's all right. Awesome. All right. Let them deceive you, eh, Pepe. Oh, Wilma, I can't come back. I've already been in Ernest's bed, and I am not a woman who sleeps with two men at the same time. Pepe, Pepe, you don't, don't say that. It doesn't, Pepe, Pepe, please, don't, just take these gifts, please. Pepe, I love you, please. Oh, Wilma, I know you need your money. Take these gifts and get your money. At least, Ernest gives me enough. Pepe, Pepe, must you call that name here, eh, Pepe? You drove me into a mess life. Remember how you, how you chased me through the night with anger and love in your heart? That night you killed the dream I had for you. The dream I had to make my future with you. Pepe, Pepe, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I still love you, Pepe. I love you. We don't share a common dream anymore, Rama. Find yourself another woman. As for me, I've accepted to love Ene and be happy. At least he never, he has never raised his voice at me or hit me. Pepe, Pepe, must you compare? Must you compare, Pepe? You see, see, love is like fire. Sometimes those we even, we love get burnt, Pepe. Burnt? 
Did you just say burnt? After all I suffered? Baby. And miscarriage? My mother's gone? And you said I deserve to be burnt? You chased me out from your house! You chased me out from your house! Not once, not twice! Please just go, Mama, just go! I, I can't. I, I, I love you. I love you, Pepe. I, I want you back. Leave my house. Our love is dead. Pepe, no, no, no. You're still alive, Pepe. The love is still alive. Pepe, don't go, please. Pepe. 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 What's going on? Pepe. Pepe, I love you, Pepe. Pepe, I love you, Pepe. Dreams of happiness or fighter. Is it a dream that will last till end or? The dream that will end halfway. What kind of dream are you sharing? Dreams of happiness or fight? Is it a dream that will last till end? Or the dream that will end halfway? What kind of love is this? Family, or I'll report you to the elders of this village. Stay away. Stay away from my family. If there's anything we forgot to bring back, eh? Remind me. I'll send it. Joana, 
you the last time and you denied it. But now I've even seen it with my own eyes. What did I deny? What did you see? I, I don't understand. That Perpetua has left you and that she's planning to get married to Emma Otaba. I even saw the both of them riding in his car. Emma, it's okay. Alright? Don't worry, things will be fine. It's alright, it's okay. it's okay. So, how are you coping? Coping fine, I'm doing well. So, who's cooking for you now? Cooking. Uh, I'm doing fine, I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine, no problem. No problem. Uh, my, my grandmother used to say that men are like big babies and they need to be cared for. Don't worry. I'll take care of you. Uh, thank you very much. I have to be going now. Okay, good night. Tonight, so I made some food for you. You made food for me? Oh, he thanks for sparing the time. Rema, you work so hard. I think you should just. Take a break and relax. Relax. This is my life. I'm married to this work now. This is good food, you know. Thank you. Thank you. I'm happy you like it. I do. You going to wash your hands? Mm, too nice, too nice. Home now. No, I won't hear till you finish. I, I think it's late too. I wait. Okay.
I don't know. I'm having some pain. Are you hungry? Should I get you something to eat? was not properly done. Perhaps you did it at a cheap and local clinic where they do not have the equipment to carry out the necessary meaning cesarean. And they must have left some placenta or membrane in her womb. And the resultant infection must have damaged her womb. Damaged? Damaged them. Actually, they were supposed to carry out a scan to make sure nothing was left behind in her womb. So, uh, it was not a standard hospital. Uh, doctor, please, what can we do now? The scan we did showed the infection was widespread. So, we had to do a total extraction of her womb. What do you mean by that? She will not be able to have any child in future. Hey! Hey! It's not the time to indulge in self-pity. She needs to be put on bread-based antibiotics. And this will cost a huge amount of money. Pull yourself together. Doctor! Doctor! Don't tell me to put myself together. Easy, easy. I am no longer to get out scattered. Don't hey, easy. look at me now. Easy. I am very hot inside. In fact, I am very hot. Easy. Hey. Easy. Say what? Go, go, go. Come on. 
Check if you have some better clothes that I can help you wash them. Uh, how thoughtful of you. Yes, I have dirty clothes. Let me go and get them. Can I thank you enough? Thank you. All right. I'll uh, bring it back as soon as it's dried. Okay. Um, Clara. Uh -huh. You know, it's amazing how fast I'm beginning to forget perpetual. You've really helped me. Thank you. So, how's your professional business doing these days? Well, it's been doing well. My customers have been very impressive. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Mama, I 
something I heard. What is it? It's about Pepecho. <laughs> what is new? She has finally married Ene. No. Oh, she's not pregnant for Ene. Not that. Then what? You say she's in the hospital. And that her womb was damaged when she had that miscarriage. And that almost cost her. From what I heard, Emma abandoned and rejected her to her fate in the hospital. She went to another cleaner, but she has been discharged. And Emma has vowed never to go ahead with the marriage, since she can never have another baby. Well, uh, uh, Petra is not, it's not part of my life anymore. Don't worry. I'm here for you. Thank you. All right. I'll see you later. A lot. Anyway, my name is Eme. Eme Otaba. I'm a bachelor and a man of class. Wow, well, I know who you are. I'm Clara, the woman's friend. Which woman? The one you know. The carpenter. You can't be serious. What's a beauty like you doing with a carpenter? Was this the same method you used in convincing Perpetua? What? What did you say? Look, and I will tell you whatever they call you. Take my advice. Go and bring Perpetua back. She loved the man she loved so much for your sake. Don't just discard her like that. The doctor says she can never have a baby. Are they gods? And the doctor is God. God is greater than medicine. She can still have another baby in the future. Good day. Never, never! I cannot go for her hand. Shut <laughs> 
have you come to see your wife? She's inside the house. You see, this is the only way to know those who love themselves. Thank you for coming here. Yeah? Please, when you are talking to her, talk to her in the language you will understand because you are the only person that can talk to her like that. Yeah? Welcome. Let me call her for you. Look at my here. Look at I am going to my canteen. Please, talk to her later. Oh? Let's sit down with her. She's so calm. Oh? not lost. Please come back with me to the house. It's your house. Our house. We can still make it work, Pepe. Please. I'm no longer worthy of you. I won't do you. No, Pepe. I caused it. Whatever you did, I drove you to it. No, you did not. I should have stayed back and worked this out, even if you beat me every day. Oh, I was also responsible for what happened to your womb. It was my baby. I was the one who took you to that hospital. And now things have turned out this way. I can never leave you. Mom, I don't want your pity. I don't deserve your pity. Pepe, I don't pity you. I love you. I do. Pepe. Please sit down. Please. Ivan. Love has no place here anymore. We both destroyed it. I told you. The dream we shared of a life together. And then the day you drove me out and I slept in a mess house. Can't you see I'm no longer worthy of you? I will always remember the good times we both spent together. But we can never be together again. Yes, we can. What matters is the love we have for each other. I love you. And I know that deep inside your heart you love me too. I wish I could turn by the hands of time. But I cannot. Everything we shared. Everything that happened to us was destined to be. So much water has passed under the bridge.
peace in your life. And let the sweet memories of what we've shared be with us forever. We can still make it work, okay? We can. Well, then you have to let me go so that you can start your life afresh. You deserve a good life because you're a good man. Please go. Yeah, Goodbye. Please, Papa. that I've been looking in the wrong direction. I was blind, but now I can see. What will be, will be. 